Hello friends, today it is how to install PHPP forum on your cPanel. This is a demo of PHPP forum, PHP BP forum. This is a demo for that forum. This is one of free forum forever. This is the bit free forum script for all. This forum may have many few features. And PHPP have a lot of lot of templates, lot of templates available in PHPP forum. Because many developers uh, develop the script templates for PHPP forum. Okay, friend, I teach how to install that forum on your C panel. First, you download that script. I give the, the download link on description for this description of this video. Click any one link. Okay? Don't click all. Just click any one link to download. I want download from rabbitsare.com So I click rabbitsare Click Download Click here to download Click the uh, green button to download that uh, file. Start download. That file was downloading. Ah, the download is successful. Okay. Then you log into your cPanel. Go to File Manager, not le Legacy File Manager. Go to only File Manager. Okay. Not a Legacy File Manager. File Manager. If you want to install that forum on your main website, w because my my main website is usrvolanka.com now. If I run that script on my usrvolanka.com, I install the di this the directory public HTML. But I also run some web I also run some scripts on that uh, main website. So I need one separate directory so I create one separate directory now the directory name is phpbp yeah just admit it I will add on my own call I create separate separate folder for that the script Click the upload button. Select the file last you downloaded. Go to that file you have stored on your disk. Ah, that file stored on that file. That file stored on. See the file. PHP 3.0. That file was uploaded, uploading in process.
okay you go to database mysql databases database create one database for the script mm. go back then create on user copy that password click I have copied this password in safe place use password and create user I create database username and database name in same name copy the password go back then you make a connection for that uh, username and that password uh, you, sorry, sorry username and uh, the database add the username to the database click on our privileges mac changes okay the username was added to the database then you click go back and yeah, the script was uploaded then right click the file and extract click the extract extract files the file was extracted successfully then reload oh that file was created on folder so I would need to move that files click the select all click move file delete the folder name then click press enter that file move to your main directory up on level yes if you install if you need to install that uh, uh, PHPP on your main directory don't type this folder name because I install that uh, that script on my web separate directory so I type this go to your website introductions click the install proceed to next step start install to database database server database server is local host this server is local host my database name and database account name are same so I put database name and do database username are same and I need to put database password proceed to next step 
successful connection the connection was tested successfully proceed to next step put your administration password uh, put your any uh, any username and password i use admin admin password you give any one password this me mail id anyone want hosting for your uh, phpp website please contact me to that mail id come to me mail address check and return and check for test pass proceed to next step you are going on on php okay proceed to next step Yeah, my friend was calling. Mm -hmm. I log into administration control panel. My script was installed. I have installed uh, PHP on my website. I don't create any forums now. You can add many forums and sub forums on this on this area. If you have any doubts about this um, PHP, please reply me or go to PHP personal website. They can solve all problems via forum. how to create po how to create forums and categories and uh, more and more on phpp how to work it on phpp uh, and i tell about this all on next videos if you want more updates from me just subscribe my channel if you subscribe my channel to get my future updates to your mail thank you thank you for watching this video my subscription link available on my video i will meet you on next video